Hello, and welcome. I am Edwin, the digital avatar for Parabin's Electronic Evidence Examiner platform. I will be your guide as we explore the powerful and intuitive functions of E3. In this video, we will explore the Parabin tool, Link2. The Link2 application is used to analyze mobile data cases created by Electronic Evidence Examiner. This easy-to-use application will help you to track links between phone numbers stored on two or more mobile devices, study call and message information associated with cases and numbers, and generate HTML reports. We begin by running Link2. In the Welcome Wizard, select whether you want to work in an existing workspace, or if you want to create a new one. To work in an existing workspace, click Open Existing Workspace, and browse to the .ws file. On the Workspace pane, you will see a list of the mobile data cases in the workspace. Click Link Analysis. A graph with the links between the numbers, stored in the mobile data cases, will be loaded. You can use Zoom Slider to zoom in and zoom out of the graph, as well as the Overview option to scroll through the displayed data. If you want to hide case data from the graph, just clear the corresponding checkboxes near the case names on the workspace pane. To make the link analysis easier, you can also hide numbers with no calls or messages or numbers found only in one case. To do this, select the checkboxes in the options section to the right. To rearrange nodes in the graph, just drag and drop them, to make the image more comprehensible. To view details of a phone number, select the required node. The information on the contact will be displayed in the Details pane, to the right. Next, go to the Timeline Data tab. It contains detailed information on all calls and messages, in cases being analyzed, and are sorted by time. If you need to hide messages or calls from the list, select the corresponding option. On the Statistic tab, you will find out how many incoming and outgoing calls and messages are associated with a specific phone number. To generate a report, click Reports and select Generate HTML Report. In the Report Wizard, select whether to include data from all cases or from only selected cases, to the report. Specify the report path, and name, and then click, Generate. In the report, you will find information on the cases, diagrams with enlargeable links, timelines and, statistics data. The report data is displayed the same as in the Link 2 tabs.